just moved it out of place, didn't I? <laughs> I can't light it. It takes two hands for me. Because you have a ton of hands. Hi, welcome to Beer Fork. I'm Melanie, bringing to you another October pumpkin beer. Let's see what we've got. All right, this bad boy is Spooky by Blue Mountain Barrel House. It is an ale brewed with pumpkin flavor and cocoa nibs and aged in bourbon barrels. So pretty awesome, very cute little label there. I will say I've had this before. I thought it was pretty darn good and specially requested that we do a video of it. Um, there is a very long back side, so I'm gonna see if I can just blow right through this. Boo! <laughs> Has there ever been a better feeling than when you were a kid spiriting around the neighborhood in a white sheet with a bucket of candy bars? No, not really. But we figured if we loaded up an imperial pumpkin ale with natural chocolate flavor from cocoa nibs and stuck it in a bourbon barrel for a few months, it might come pretty close. And then it says, a little bit about Blue Barrel Mountain House was created by the founders of Blue Mountain Brewery, Nelson County, Virginia. The barrel house also resides in Nelson County where the woods are deep, the mountains are bold, and great beer flows through the land. Try each style of our exquisite original beer. And then, this beer is alive. Please, ensure it has been kept in good storage conditions. Barrel house beers are bottled with a portion of live beer and undergo bottle re-fermentation. If the bottom layer of yeast is disturbed during handling, allow the beer to settle upright for a few days before consumption. Extended cool cellaring of this beer is possible but drink by the date stamped on the cork for peak flavor. All right, so that's something that, you know, I even learned about recently is that a lot of these, they will do what's called bottle finishing, where what they're doing is they're actually adding a little bit of, I think, the yeast back into the bottle so that it'll keep fermenting and they've got to hit that nice balance so that it doesn't actually blow the whole bottle. Um, I'm guessing that's why they use this kind of like cork to really seal it in, otherwise you're going to pop a regular type cap. That's just my guess. If you guys know for sure, I'd love to hear from you. Uh, this is 8.2 ABV, so, and that's pretty much it for what we've got on here. This might take me a minute to get into, because it is got a cork instead of our usual pop top. All right, let's see if I can get this open. All right, right on up. And it's open. <laughs> All right, and I'm sure I am disturbing the heck out of it. It did not that graceful. Go, 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 go. All righty, beautiful. All right, let's see. That is a very nice amber color. You can see right through it. Got some nice little bubbles, nice little head. I do like the color. Um, trying to not block it up. It's a little bit lighter amber color, but that is really pretty. Let's see what we smell. Okay, so right off the bat, <laughs> I get bourbon. <laughs> um, I do like bourbon. I like it better than tequila. Okay, so underneath the bourbon, we're hiding our pumpkin, and I get a little bit of the cocoa nibs kind of rounding it out. So right from the nose, you're getting everything that they've described. Let's give it a taste. Hmm. That is really enjoyable. So again, it tastes a lot like the way it smells. So you get the bourbon on top, the pumpkin and the chocolate are 
intermingling and then you get a nice chocolate aftertaste like this is nice it's like it's just all sort of swirling around there's nothing in particular that's like demanding your attention you just you just it's like I'm playing hide and seek with the flavors in this it's like one will pop up and then a different one and yeah this is this is pretty spectacular mmm I should have said spooktacular. Oh my gosh, though, that is really good. Yeah. This is just as good as I remembered it, and I'm really glad that I've been able to share it with you. So again, this is Spooky by Blue Mountain Barrel House. Thank you guys for making it. It's a delicious beer. I'm Melanie with Beer Fork, and I hope to see you again. Check out our links. We're on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter.